Hey guys, this is Mark and today I want to talk about how to deal with negative people. And so we're going to reframe negative behavior right off the bat. Negative behavior often stems from personal insecurities, past experiences, or the need to control. So by recognizing this, you can approach these situations with more empathy and patience, knowing that their negative behavior has little to do with you and in some cases has nothing to do with you. It's all junk that's going on inside of them. So one of the most effective ways to handle negative people is by maintaining a positive mindset. I know that's easier said than done, but when faced with negativity, it's important to remember that their behavior is not a reflection of your worth. So in the heat of the moment, try to remind yourself of your own value and stay focused on the positive aspects of your life. Next point, Negative people can sometimes cross boundaries and bring toxicity into your life. So it's crucial to set clear boundaries in those cases and communicate them very assertively. Let them know what you will and will not tolerate and stand firm in enforcing these boundaries. The next point, when dealing with negative people, as paradoxical as it sounds, practice active listening. Truly hearing what they have to say can and often does help diffuse the situation and shows them that their concerns are being acknowledged. This doesn't necessarily mean that you have to agree with them, but it shows respect and can pave the way to finding some common ground. And I know it's hard to actively listen to negativity, especially when it's directed towards you, but you'll be surprised how much that tempers things. Next point, cultivating empathy and understanding is crucial when dealing with negative people. You want to try to put yourself in their shoes and understand why they might be feeling and acting the way they are. That's another hard one to do. Empathize with somebody who's being negative toward me and maybe even about me and I'm supposed to empathize. Empathy simply means I'm going to try to peel myself out of my skin, crawl into their skin, look out of their eyeballs and try to see their perspective and how they might be feeling based on their perspective. Now this doesn't excuse their behavior, but it can help you approach the situation with more compassion and patience. And you wanna have compassion and patience for your benefit. If they benefit as well, great. But the compassion and patience business is more so you can maintain your serenity in the heat of the moment. Now, in some cases it may be necessary to avoid or disengage from negative people. If their presence consistently brings you down or hinders your personal growth, it's perfectly okay to distance yourself. Focus on surrounding yourself with positive influences that uplift and inspire you. On that note, to counterbalance the effects of negative people, you want to intentionally surround yourself with positive people. Seek out supportive friends, mentors, who uplift and encourage you, engage in activities that bring you joy, and help you to maintain a positive mindset. Next point, dealing with negative people can be emotionally draining. So it's crucial to prioritize self-care and stress management in order to replenish your energy. So take time for activities that bring you relaxation and joy, practice mindfulness, make sure you're getting enough rest and exercise. Next point, even in the presence of negative people, it's important to find the positive aspects of any situation, and the best way to do that is to practice gratitude. I know, another difficult one. I'm supposed to practice gratitude when at some level I feel like I'm being victimized? Again, this is for your benefit. Practice gratitude and focus on the things that bring you joy. And by shifting your attention to the positive, you can maintain your own happiness and be a source of inspiration for others. So in summary, when confronted with negativity, it's going to be important to stay focused on your goals and aspirations. Don't allow negative people to derail your progress or discourage your dreams. Instead, use their negativity as fuel to propel you forward and to prove them wrong. In the heat of the moment, practice gratitude. After the dust has settled, practice self-care and stress management. Surround yourself with positive people. Remember the negativity of others is not a reflection of your worth. Don't take it personally. Instead, remind yourself of your own value and the positive impact you can make in the world. Let their words and actions slide off you and keep moving forward with confidence. Disengage and avoid negative people when needed. Try to see things from their perspective so you can at least understand why they're so upset. Actively listen to their complaints. Set boundaries when needed and understand that their negativity is a result of their personal insecurities, past experiences, and need to control, not a reflection on you.